What is going on guys welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here today I am back with another Fortnite video and today I bring you 10 amazing weapons come to Fortnite Battle Royale But before we get into that people I am giving away 2800 V-Bucks to win simply subscribe to the channel if you're new around here Hit that bell button to turn notifications on drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below I pick and contact winners via direct message. So good luck, guys. Now, according to official Fortnite Battle Royale game files, which have been data mined, we have found upcoming new weapons. Now, these data mines are 99.9% .9 correct, and the weapons we have previously covered, such as the hunting rifle, the heavy shotgun, have been added into the game. So we see no reason why these won't be added in the future too. So let's get into it. Okay, so first up we have the M249 saw, an assault weapon, a slow firing, high impact, automatic rifle with a large magazine. Now this weapon is available within the Save the World game mode, as you can see on screen now, a monster of power, but let down by slow rate of fire. Somewhat accurate, will definitely be effective at medium ranges. This will come in that rare and epic rarities by the way. Next up we have the FNP90, a machine pistol. Now this I can imagine being a great weapon to use at close ranges. A lot like the current close range full auto weapons, actually a lot more effective than people give them credit for. Now this I will come in that rare rarity, no other variant has been found within the data mined files. Next up we have the assault weapon slug gun, the hammer crush. Now this is a weapon found in the save the world game mode also, it's a rifle that fires slugs with high damage and impact it has great accuracy but a relatively slow rate of fire now i can't say 100 that how these weapons work in the save the world game mode will cross over into the battle royale obviously changes will be made to said weapons we do find within the change the world game mode now this hammer crush will be of that legendary rarity and i definitely look forward to using this for sure next up we have the moab launches a tiny rocket that makes a big boom now this again is available within the save the world game mode now I believe this will work much like the grenade launch but offering a much bigger bang but holding limited ammo or shots. The mother of all bombs makes it sound like a game changer and it could just be that. This mob is of that legendary rarity. Next up we have the light machine gun. Okay so this thing seems like it will be a monster much like the minigun. A heavy gun with high damage, an extreme rate of fire and a huge magazine. Very inaccurate unless aiming down sights from a fixed position and firing in short bursts. So with this description, is it stating you can fix this to things? That would be new for sure. Imagine if running around with it also makes you slower too. Mechanics which are changed via the weapon you use sounds great to me. This is a light machine gun will come in that legendary and epic rarities. Next up we have the tactical assault rifle. This legendary variant assault weapon is full auto. It's flexible and capable of handling all types of combat scenarios. High rate of fire with solid accuracy when aiming down sights and firing in controlled bursts. Now for me weapons as such are needed, I mean uh, we have a couple of decent auto rifles but just just not enough, besides shotguns they are no doubt the most used, might even be used more than shotguns, doubtful but it could be the case. I just feel weapons for overall combat in all different battle scenarios are needed, this and a few others we've seen and will see will fit in nicely in my opinion. Next up we have the Egg Launcher, now this weapon there just isn't much known about it, it's definitely though a part of those battle royale files. When is it coming? Where is it coming? If it's going to be a part of a limited time game mode, much like the mob might be, we just don't know yet. This though I think will act like the grenade launcher, but instead of firing grenades, it will fire eggs. These eggs no doubt won't damage you, but maybe they'll stick it to the spot, maybe slow you down, limit your building etc for a few seconds. It makes sense because we don't really have counters for much in this game. This could be one of a new theme of weapons introduced to the game to counter such things. We will see people. Rarity this thing I believe is not known yet. Next up we have the explosive crossbow. This epic variant shoots an arrow with an explosive tip, your enemy's worst nightmare. For me I believe this will act much like the crossbows in game now by exploding on impact causing damage to nearby enemies and structures. Having a crossbow that explodes but does nothing the standard crossbow doesn't do is pretty pointless so there has to be something extra with this thing and I believe an area of effect damage output is in my opinion what this thing will offer. 
Next up we have the Precision Rifle, an assault weapon that fires tight bursts that allows for precise targeting in mobile mid-range engagements, deals good damage but consumes its magazine very quickly. This weapon comes in legendary, epic and rare variants. Now we all know of the burst AR in the game right now, for me it's very inconsistent, sometimes it works amazingly, other times I can't hit things not even moving that are right in front of me, I know Bloom comes into play a lot but with burst weapons it feels much worse because of that pause between the shots you get. I'm hoping this burst weapon is much like the best weapon we have in game now but shoots much quicker. If this is the case though I doubt its range will be as good but we will see people we will see. And lastly we have the airstrike laser. Mark a location to deliver an airstrike with a 4 bomb payload. This legendary weapon I feel will work much like the airstrike works in the save the world game mode. Mark that location, pull that trigger and wait. This I can see being really useful in Battle Royale, but I do believe if it is coming it will be introduced into a limited time game mode first before it's put into the standard Battle Royale playlists. I could be wrong here though. Now I know what many of you will be thinking, this seems a little OP. I thought the same at first, but we know how epic roll. This I guarantee you won't be as effective as you might think. I think its range will be real limited in two ways. At a distance you can mark a target and natural explosive area effect damage it deals. I also definitely think as well it will also warn enemies or they will get some kind of indication which lets them know that this thing is coming so they can get out of there. It will be great for clearing out buildings though people build and camp in. I actually can't wait to see this thing in the game. Should be epic for sure. And guys, that is it. 10 amazing weapons come to Fortnite Battle Royale. Let me know which from this list you are most looking forward to. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really does help me out. Thanks as always for stopping by as always. If you're new around here and enjoy what you just saw, be sure to subscribe. Again, thanks for stopping by and hopefully people, I will see you on that next one. Always in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I will carry on, we never get it right.